Hi everyone, welcome to my crazy crafty life. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul. There are a lot of new craft items, so we're going to jump into it. The first um, items I found were these boxes. They've had these before, but um, I just thought I'd show you. They have pink, yellow, and blue. I think they have orange too, but I didn't get those. They, have, they look like this, and then they have the clear lid. They're from the teaching tree, although I found them in where they sell the storage bins. And then they have these little locking pieces. Great for crafts and all kinds of things, so pick some of those up. And they're a good size, too. can fit a lot in there. Okay. Another thing from the teaching tree, and I really wish they had these when my kids were little, but it's the first day of, and then you could write, you know, first grade, second grade, kindergarten, whatever it is. And they're double-sided, so the other side has, uh, my teacher is, when I grow up I want to be, I am years old, my favorite color book activity. These are really neat. I love these. I really wish my kids had, they, they had these. Um, I had done it like on a chalkboard one year, but this one says first day of. It's a little bit different. And then on the back, it has the same, the same things as the other one, but it has like the ice cream and the fruit and flour. It's just a little bit different. It's a heart, different shapes, really cute. Thought that was a good find. I really wish that they had those for my kiddos. Um, let's see. Another thing I found, this is from the teaching tree. It's the reusable try erase pocket. I think these are really awesome. I've actually ordered these on Amazon before they started carrying them. But this one even comes with the addition and subtraction. But if you look at the other side, they also have the writing one as well. So that's really neat. But I also thought it would just be cool to use as a dry erase board. If you needed to hang a sign up temporarily or something, that could be really cool. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm still dealing with allergies slash cold. I'm not sure what's going on, but um, you're probably going to hear me clear my throat a lot, so I'm sorry. Um, the next things I found were these dry erase boards. They're pretty good size, um, and they've had these. These are definitely not new. They have the magnet on the back, um, but I just wanted something for... Well, the pink one I'm probably going to keep in my craft room, but this one I'm going to put um, on my kitchen, on my on my uh, refrigerator door. Um, yeah, just so we can keep track of like messages and things like that. Because I'm a visual person, I really need reminders, so these would be good to have for that purpose. Another thing I picked up, which is definitely not new, it's these no-slip rug um, underlay, they call it. No-slip rug underlay. And that's what they look like. They work great. I recommend them. These are really good. <clears throat> I put them pretty much on all my rugs because even the, the ones that claim they're no-slip, um... They tend to slide eventually, so um, this was a repurchase. I definitely hauled this before, but I noticed that one of the corners was broken, so I just picked up another one to replace it. 
This is an 8x10 gold frame. <laughs> um, then I found this glass piece, which is new. I don't think I've ever seen this. But a really cute beachy vibe. And they had other colors. They had like a navy. Definitely a navy and then this. And it's so cute. I mean, it's got the little fish. Kind of looks like a piece of wood. I think it's adorable. <laughs> Another glass, glass items. Sorry, she did wrap them for me, so that's good. Um, were these iridescent ones? And I think I might have seen these before. At least this one. I know I've gotten this one. But that one. And then there was this blue one, which I really liked. And I just like that you could um, use these for decoration, put some flowers in there. It'd be really cute. And then there was, oh goodness. And there was this lavender iridescent one too. They're so pretty. I'll show you all of them together. Each of them have a different pattern. They all have the leaves, um, but they're just all so pretty. They'd be pretty together or separate, whichever you prefer. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see. Some stickers that I found. These are like some rock and roll themed stickers. Um, they have guitar, tape. I like the old fashioned tape. Um, this is rock and roll. Oh, that one doesn't. That one says dance to the beat of your dreams. Then there's rock and roll. There's the music. There's um, instruments. Really, really cool. Um, this one definitely isn't new. I know I've hauled these. Pretty sure they're the old-fashioned books. I don't know what's going on. My lighting's not good. But it's the old-fashioned books there. So those are really cute. Um, another thing I found were these removable picture strips. They're from the tool bench. And they're like the Velcro. They they look so much like the um, what do they call it? the command strip ones. Um, I don't know if they work as well, but it does say four pairs holds up to five pounds. Yeah, no, I'm not sure. <laughs> but if you wanted to hang up something really light, this would probably work fine. Then, <clears throat> excuse me. Then I found this flash memory game. So I guess it comes with the battery already. <laughs> I remember this game from when I was young. I can't remember what the name of the, of the game was, but very similar. And it's just in a mini size and there's an on off switch in the back really cute. Okay, into some craft items. Um, I did find this floral foam and you get four in here. So they sell ones that are a solid, but this one is the four pack, which I liked. Um, okay. Last time I showed the ones that said welcome and was welcome and home and then these say hello. So I, I just really liked these. They also had a rainbow. It's kind of just like a wood um, cut out of a rainbow in the middle. I didn't really pick it up because I had a feeling that I probably wouldn't use it. But they that is an option that they have. 
Okay, another thing I found, they put out a whole bunch of planner stickers. And there were, they had so many different colored themes. But I really liked this one. It was like the gold with the magenta and black. Black and white, magenta, gold. So really pretty. I have the same on the other side. I think it says you get 58 pieces. So that's really cool. Okay. Uh, let's see. I found... <clears throat> This looks new. I haven't seen it before. It's LA Colors Perfect Pair Shimmery Nail Polish and Nail File. So the nail file is a strawberry shape. So cute. And then you get the shimmery nail polish as well. I think you can kind of see that a little bit. Hopefully. Okay. Um, then I found some <clears throat> blank note cards. These are Hallmark brand and I just really liked the simplicity because you could do a lot of things. You could write, you know, put I love you or happy birthday. You could write whatever you want and then just fill the inside because it's blank and you get six. So this would be just great to have in case you have a you need for a card and you don't have one. You know, thinking of you. There's a lot of things you could do with those. Then I found these summer-themed gnomes. And a while back, quite a while back, I hauled their summer garden, fairy garden stuff. And I just thought these would be adorable in there. So if you're looking for gnomes, these are stinking cute. <laughs> Okay, another boring thing is um, reading glasses. These are the 1.25. I highly recommend them because they're cheap. So if they break, you just go buy another pair. And I think they work great. <laughs> and they're great just to have around different places in case you need them. I like to use them. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Especially when I'm sewing and doing anything small because it's really hard to see sometimes. Okay. And then I found a whole bunch of fabric that I hadn't seen before. <clears throat> so I found this lavender. This one is 100% cotton. And usually they carry just cotton, but you'll see that I found other ones. This is another one that's cotton. It's the orange in the tie-dye. Um, and then I found winter gnomes. And it's really cute. Winter gnome fabric. And I hadn't seen this before, so I don't know why they're putting it out now. I guess maybe because, I mean, if it's new, I'm guessing because people need to craft early for Christmas. But um, I just, I'm just finding it now. And then I found <clears throat> the red and black buffalo check. That one is also 100% cotton. Um, this one is a mix, it says. 97% cotton, 3% other fibers. And it's like this pastel Easter, Easter colors, almost like a plaidish. Really pretty. I thought it was cute. And that makes no sense because if that, if they're trying to get things out early, um, that's an Easter one, which is right around the corner. So, um, yeah, I don't really know what they're trying to do. Um, and then I found this, this one's also the 97 cotton and 3% other fibers, but it's this, uh, gingham fabric. Very, very cute. Um, another one of the blend fabrics is this one. 
which I think would match the buffalo check pretty well, and the gingham if you wanted to do like a quilt or something. Um, and then I found this pink stripe, that's also the mixed fabric. Um, and then I found just a pink one. It has kind of like a, a woven look to it. Um, but yeah, it's, that's pretty. <clears throat> Let's see, I got a few more. This is the mixed fabric. It's like this orange. Again, I think fall or even Easter because I'm not a big fan of orange, but this color I could get behind. <laughs> it's kind of like an orangey yellow color. And then I found this one. You get quite a bit more than the other ones. And it's 97 cotton, 3% other fiber, and it's like this cream color. There's, there's a line through here. I don't know if that's like the remnant it edge because the rest of it looks like it's just the cream color. <coughs> and then I found this one in the mixed fabric, which is the black and white buffalo check. And I've hauled the um, cotton one before, but this is a mix. Now 97%, it's almost, it's not quite, but it's pretty close. Um, then I found this fabric. It kind of looks like um, it has different things. It says Need Coffee. Um, and there's like lipstick and a tape and a star. <laughs> um, yeah, so and sunglasses on the bottom. And it says yes over here, so it's like, it's got a bunch of different things on it. It's so cute. Um, and then I found a green tie-dye. This is 100% cotton. And... Oh yeah, there's more. <laughs> um, is that all of them? Hold on. Okay. And I found blue. So I found every color in the rainbow for the um, tie-dye. Blue, pink, yellow, and purple. So cute. Um, and then I found rainbow, so that would be cute if you were doing a quilt. And these were these are a hundred percent cotton. And then I found this one's so pretty. It's um, unicorns with flowers, and it's got the navy blue background. So pretty. It's a unicorn. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm probably going to say that a lot. Oh, goodness. And then Crafter Square continually, continually surprises me. Um, so last time I showed a dark blue removable vinyl. This time I found the gray color. It's kind of like a light gray. Pretty. And then I found the faux leather, and it's not very thick, and it's not sticky either, so it's just the leather, but this could be really cool to craft with. You could make a lot of things. And they had navy blue, black, this brownish, and a white. And I thought these were really cool because, <laughs> oh my gosh, I thought these were really cool because you could make probably covers for your phone, like little holders or keychain or earrings. I've seen people do a lot of things with these. So, and you can see here, there's almost like a rainbow of like it swatches so I'm hoping that they'll put out more so that was an exciting pretty exciting find okay and there's more this is gonna be a, a little bit of a longer haul 
Um, okay, another thing I found was a scientific calculator. <laughs> and they had them in colors. Like, they're all black, but they have, like, the little... The edge is a different color. So this is, like, a purpley-pink kind of color. Really cool. I was kind of shocked to find a scientific calculator. I'm sure this doesn't do everything, but it's got the sine, cosine. Yeah, it's got a lot of different things. So for a basic one, that might work. Um, I found another sensory toy, stress relief. It's called a fidget chain, clink and snap. And they had other colors too. But the blue and green I kind of liked. Um, I found, I, I know they've had these before. These are definitely not new. Um, or the dream catchers. But I found the unicorn, the rainbow, and the heart. Um, and they're all slightly different depending. Like if you look at them, even just looking at the top string that, hang, that you hang them on. They were, <clears throat> excuse me, they were slightly different. Um, it just depends on what they grabbed for when they were making them, I guess. Um, because some of them had blue and purple, some of them had more pink and orange. So, yeah. So, I like them. I think they're cool. Um, another fidget thing I found was this car shape. This is like the traditional, but I just thought the little car shape was adorable. Another new thing I found was this bike phone holder. I was kind of intrigued. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean it shows you could put it on bicycle, shopping cart, or on a baby stroller. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, and they show a picture on how they how it's used. So it's like a strap that goes over the phone. So that's interesting. Um, let's see. Another new item are these La La Loopsy. <coughs> Excuse me, La La Loopsy Littles, <laughs> and. This one's like the, the bath towel with the hood. And then there's this one with the little outfit. Um, and I think there's another one, the pajamas. But these are the only two that I found. But here's the picture of the three. And I didn't see the dolls. I have no idea if they're carrying the dolls. But I remember my youngest playing with these. These were the cutest little dolls. Um, I got some candles and they had other scents and I know I've gotten these before so these are not new but they've just put them back out and I got the strawberry shortcake and the glass is so pretty and even the label is cute although this one looks a little bit messed up but it's Dollar Tree so that <laughs> kind of expect that this one's a little bit better <laughs> strawberry shortcake so cute and it smells pretty good even with my sinus issues <laughs> I'm able to smell them so I think those are pretty good um, another craft item I found was the embroidery needle bundle they're calling it they had a floral, they had a polka dot, and they had a floral in blue and a polka dot in blue as well, and the polka dot in pink. Um, but I got the floral. It's really cute. Kind of curious because um, I've tried to use these before, and I end up not liking them, but... Um, let's see. So you just kind of like put it on your wrist. Oh, it's not bad actually. I kind of like it with the elastic because I think the other ones I've gotten were different. But that would be kind of cool when you're sewing to have that. I wonder too, like, if you hung it on something too. 
you know, near your sewing machine, if that would work as well. Or glue it to a jar. I'm sure there's different things you could try. Okay, another thing I got, super boring, they've had it before, are these white rocks. <clears throat> I want to make a, a little Easter bouquet, which I might do a video on because I haven't really posted any new videos, <laughs> craft videos lately. Um, so I may do that one because it's super easy and quick and Easter is right around the corner. So I may do that one. Um, let's see. The next thing I found were the Tumbling Tower game. You get 72, which is not new, but it looks like they updated the package. It used to be blue, and now they have brown. Either way, I love these little tumbling tower blocks because they're great for crafts. And I like the 72 because they used to carry half that amount, so it would be the 36? Yes, 36. <laughs> I uh, had to do some math there. Um, <laughs> 36, and now they have the 72, which they're charging an extra 25 cents, which they did before they raised their prices, but um, I certainly wouldn't want to pay $1.25 for 36 when I can get 72 for the same price. And then they've brought back these round wood pieces, which I'm very happy they did because I've been looking for more. So they're back. Um, they also had a star shape, but I didn't need any more of those. Um, but keep your eyes out because these are really nice. They're pretty thick. And um, there's a lot of good things you can make with these. Um, let's see. Is that it? That is it. That is it for this haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, please remember to give me a thumbs up, like, and a comment down below. Um, subscribe if you're new, please. I could use all the subscribers I can get right now. I'm over a hundred and I'm so excited that um, I'm getting more views on my videos lately. So keep it, keep it up guys. I appreciate all of you. I love you all. Thank you so, so much. Your support means everything to me. It's the reason why I keep coming back and I will catch you on the next one. Bye guys.